independence to us it means not to be enslaved to anybody. I don't know how they, they interpret politically, but with me. It's not whether we join Burma or not. It just means that we will not be a slave to uh, the Burmese or anybody, any nation in the world. That's what the people want. For some, independent means hating the Burmese, uh, to have nothing to do with the Burmese. But I don't feel that way. I'm, I don't hate the Burmese. In fact, I might hate myself for hating them, uh, because I'm, according to uh, our religious thing, teachings, we are not allowed to love or hate anybody. We have to help our own community. And that's the teaching. It can be interpreted from a small village to a nation. When the non-Burmans are fighting for the state's rights and the Burmans are fighting for democratic rights, they should join hands together uh, with a two-prong attack. Uh, only by joining hands they have a chance to win. Without us, they are nothing. And without them, it'll be hard for the non-Burmans to win it also. These days, the NDF is no longer a very attractive coalition, non-Burman coalition anymore. Members, but they are working together. Mm -hmm. uh, there, there are others, UNLD, no. uh, ENSCC, and so on. Several of them, even the, though they have formed the setups, Chance have been like dialogue partners with them. Mm -hmm. uh, if they hold a meeting, the Shans are invited, the Shans go there. There may come a time when the Shans have to decide whether they, whether they want or not. It's like that uh, inside too. Mm -hmm. The SNLD is not a member of the UNLD, no. Union Nationalities League for Democracy, a United Front. But they work together. They work uh, more efficiently as non-members. The Chinese have more experience than the Burmese about a federation. Mm -hmm. We had the federated Shan states before. There were 34 states, you know. Well, of, of course, they were only small, very small states. But we were able to set up a federation and live together. There were two states that wanted to secede. Kokang wanted to secede, but continue, but agreed to uh, be a member of the federation, and then we allowed it to secede. There was another one, uh, Meng Pa. It wanted to secede too, and join the Karani, and the federation allowed them too. The only trouble was that the Karani wouldn't accept them. <laughs> we wouldn't have uh, problems like the Burma, the Burmese. Mm -hmm. They didn't have any experience about this. They thought that uh, united, being united means they, we, all of us should listen to them. <laughs> I hope the future leaders of Shan State uh, remember what their forefathers did. 40, 50 years ago, and they, they, I, I hope they still remember the forefathers' experiences with the Federation.